after product assignment. Next step is layout estimating. This section introduces the steps on how to generate accurate estimate on material usage, such as linear length, square footage, boxes of tiles, etc. How to manipulate seam layout for roll goods, like carpet and vinyl. Click on Estimate ribbon. In the pop-up window, it shows a list of items that are currently assigned to rooms this project. For commercial edition, check box estimate by layer controls. If product usages are calculated and separated by floor layer tab, click on OK button. The program automatically calculates all product usages and does seam layout. On the right main diagram window, rooms with roll goods are laid out with seams. Now, left panel switches from product services to estimating panel. Under estimating panel, usage quantities, linear footage, and number of tile counts, waste ratios, etc. are listed. Drag on right edge of the panel to adjust its size. Also, scroll to find all columns. Each column title can be dragged and be relocated in any order convenient to reviewing the estimating data. When clicking on any item on the list, rooms with that item assigned are highlighted in diagram window. Also, at same time, the lower panel below shows the list of room labels with this item being assigned. As a cross-reference, scroll the panel to see estimate data on each room. Navigate through the list so as to review if they match with the project spec. Under Estimate ribbon, commands are grouped by functional tabs. On the left part, Estimate tab contains estimating commands. Mouse over one to see its tip, or hit F1 key to see details in user guide. With this auto layout button, the program compares two layout direction results for roll good items and selects layout with minimum waste at project level. Click horizontal layout button to lay out seam in horizontal direction or use vertical button for vertical layout direction for roll goods. Next, option tab has commands to set layout direction by wall segment. Toggle button to control automatic re-estimating when changes made. Clear estimate data command and estimate by layer status box which will be revisited later. Seam tab contains commands to add length seam, cross seams, and to delete seams. Seam tool tab contains commands to switch seam to another side of room, switch layout direction, or lock seam locations on selected rooms. Under dividing and stairway tab, dividing commands are advanced tool for dividing an open area into different regions that seam can be manipulated independently. Set steps per cut is to control how many steps is to be covered by one cut on selected stairway. Zoom and view tabs are similar to takeoff ribbon, provided under view option pull down, one can control estimating related views such as cut sheet, cut label and size display, and cut over lay on diagram, and show product schedule is a helpful in review product schedule with the diagram view.